that. Okay. So before we get started off with the therapy, we're just going to do a little mini assessment. Um, what I want you to do is lift your chin up to the ceiling for me. Good. And I want you to hold your breath lightly for three seconds, whatever that means to you. And relax. Do it again. Hold your breath lightly for three seconds. And relax. Let's do it again three more times. Hold your breath lightly. Good. And relax. And keep your chin up. And if you can't do these last two, it's going to feel a little weird. But jut your jaw forward like that. Good. And now hold your breath lightly. And relax. And the last one. Hold your breath lightly. And relax. All right, you can uh, put your chin back down. Um, so for those who are having you hold your breath to see if you could close your vocal folds together, how many of those do you think you held your breath and kind of closed your vocal folds? Mm -hmm. Of those five. All of them. Okay. Um, at least two of them you did not. A third one, I don't have the best memory. I think you might not have either. Um, or you kind of did and then kind of did not. Um, so about half them you did, half them you did not. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn you to face this monitor. Okay. Can you see the monitor okay? Slightly. Okay, I'm going to see if I can do that. All right. Can you see the monitor now, kind of? Yeah. Okay, great. So if you go ahead and uh, say E for five seconds, go ahead and do that. E. And I want you to see those middle uh, white strips of tissue in the middle of the screen. Relax. Do you see them? Yes. So those are your vocal folds. You can see right now they're kind of open a little bit like a V. Do you see that? Yes. And you can see that they come together when you hold your breath or when you use your voice, right? So go ahead and say E again and notice how they come together. E. Excellent. So you see how they came together? Yes. Now do a nice slow sniff and see how it comes out like a V. Good. And you see how they're apart there? Yes. Okay. So one of the things that we were seeing in your previous swallowing evaluation is that food and liquid is oftentimes going into your voice box before you swallowed. So your voice box include those vocal folds. They attach to those balls of cartilages, those kind of weird things right here and right there. Um, so those are what actually move your vocal folds. We have this kind of circular, half circular shaped structure right there in the middle of the screen. That's called your epiglottis and it folds over your voice box of so your airway and protects it when you swallow. And in that crease and kind of in the middle part of the screen right there behind the arytenoids, that's the entrance into your food pipe. So we don't want anything in like the middle circle, your voice box area. Um, below your vocal folds, that's your windpipe. So if something went down there, that would be what we call aspiration. And when it's in your voice box, so when it's at your vocal folds or maybe um, in that little space up right above it, that's what we call penetration, where something went into your voice box, it's kind of in like a warning zone, but it didn't get aspirated yet. So what we think is gonna be helpful for you from a swallowing standpoint is for you to learn to hold your breath and close off your vocal folds before you swallow. Then maintain that uh, vocal fold closure as you go immediately into a swallow, and then give us a little cough right after you swallow before you open up your vocal folds. So that's what we want to try to train you to do over these next couple of minutes and have you practice that at home um, without the camera. So what I want you to do right now is I just want you to hold your breath and I want you to look at your vocal folds and try to make them come together and relax. Were you able to bring them together when you hold your breath? Yes. Good. Let's do that again. Hold your breath lightly and relax. Were you able to um, bring them together? Yeah. Good, let's just do three more like that. I'm gonna to try to get a little bit closer so you can see. Hold your breath. Relax. Two more. Hold your breath. Relax. And just do a nice, easy breath hold. Hold your breath. And relax. So were those light breath holds? Do you feel like you're doing a lot of effort or a little effort? Medium effort. And did you close your vocal folds together all the way? Yes. Okay, good. 
Let's see if you can do a couple more with very light effort, but still make them come together. So we want the idea is that you're minimizing the amount of effort so you can actually do it pretty consistently, not getting out of breath. So just a light breath hold, but still make them come together. So show me light. And relax. Was that a light breath hold? Light, yeah. Good. And did they come together? Yes. All right, good. Let's do two more like that. Light breath hold. Relax. One more. Light breath hold. Relax. Were you able to bring them together? Yes. Totally agree. Did this feel a little bit different than the little mini assessment we did beforehand, or you're not quite sure? Not quite sure. Something new that you're thinking about, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So what I want you to do is I want you to show me the wrong way on purpose so you have a sense of what that feels like. So I want you to hold your breath, but don't let your vocal folds come together. This might now be a little challenging. So hold your breath. Oh, can you make it not come together? Can you open it and just stop breathing? <laughs> a little hard now, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if you can do a couple more. So just maybe instead of closing your vocal folds now, just stop breathing for about three seconds. Kind of like that. Good. Let's do um, one more like that. This is the wrong way, and this is what you would do sometimes um, when asked to hold your breath. So open them up and relax. Good. So did you um, kind of hold your breath lightly? Yes. But they still kept open, right? Okay, good. Um, let's do the right way on purpose now. So hold your breath and make them come together and relax. What feels different about that one? The amount of pressure. So the does it, effort. a little bit more effort. And do you feel like the effort is a little bit more focused in your throat? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So hold your breath lightly. Relax. One more time. Excellent. Okay. I'm All right, so now I'm going to uh, have you turn a little bit more towards me. Don't look at the camera anymore. Excellent. And I just want you to do the breath hold. So whenever you're ready, go ahead and hold your breath lightly. And relax. Can you close it? All right. Let's do it again. Hold. Two, three. Relax. Did you do it? All right, let's do a couple more. Hold. Two, three. Relax. Did you do it? Yeah, all three of those, you did it. Let's. So I'm just gonna end with a little mini assessment of just that first thing that we did, which is the breath hold, okay? After we do five of these, I'm gonna ask you how you think you did. Got it? All right, so lift your chin up a little to the ceiling, and now we'll get started. Go ahead and hold your breath. Relax. Sweet again, hold. Relax, again, and hold, relax, I think just one more, go ahead and hold, relax. So how did you do that time? Uh, were any of them wrong? I feel like two of them, I put more effort. Okay, do you think you closed your vocal folds for all of them, or do you think only yeah. for two of them? Okay. Yeah. Exactly. So this time, it looks like you did them all correct. You closed your vocal folds, um, and it seems like your sensation is pretty good. All right, good work.